So it just a very quick, a very quick wrap up. Team gets the computer ready. Uh, well, I think this has been a very fast but very fruitful meeting. Um, the idea, the idea is for um, for us now to uh, you know that there is the the, the euro call, uh, the euro call in, in, in August coming up. There will be a uh, meeting there. Uh, so we invite you to a mall seat meeting. Uh, we invite you also to uh, mm, attend the meeting and uh, if you have also things that you would like to present there, you, you'll receive further uh, information about how it's going to proceed. Uh, but the idea is uh, connecting uh, what we've done here today and with well, whatever uh, uh, we get for the for the Euro call uh, meeting, prepare a monograph with uh, you know the, the people who have attended here today and the people who will attend um, the Euro call uh, meeting. So keep that in mind. Uh, the, the idea of the whole the whole idea of the SIG is to do things together, and at, the, at this point, the easiest way to collaborate to start collaborating is by starting. Uh, publishing together on what we are doing. Just to, to say as well, on the, on the Atlas website, there's a link through to the, um, the Eurocorp Mall C. Uh, we're getting a wiki going, there's some stuff on there. As part of that, um, as well as the wiki, we've got a um, LinkedIn group, which um, you're very welcome to, to belong to. And we've also got on Flotero, uh, we're starting off, we've got 100 and something, 130, I think, um, references. I'll try and get some of Josh's references in there as well, which we're commenting. Thanks to Maria Hortman, who's, who's left, unfortunately, who did most of the work on that. So um, you're very welcome to participate in, in this group. Now, the, the thing was, the, now we all know each other a bit better, we know each other's interests, it's a lot easier to begin to collaborate and work together on stuff. I mean, now, especially with the, the Horizon 2020 proposals coming out, Erasmus Plus, I think it's a good moment to, to begin to talk to each other. Yeah, there's also an interesting uh, mobile learning conference uh, coming up soon where we are not involved as a SIG but um, will be of interest to you and actually the, um, the final submission for deadline is very close, right? The, uh, will you say something on this, on the, on the World Conference and context on Oh, certainly. Sorry, I'm, I'm in only in very general terms. Uh, MLearn started in 2002. Um, and has taken place annually and on a kind of global basis. So it went from Birmingham, London, Melbourne, uh, Florida, uh, Cape Town, uh, Qatar, and uh, sorry, Helsinki. This year, meaning this October, it'll take place in Istanbul. Um, and it's the annual conference of the International Association for Mobile Learning. And we, the, the directors of the association, effectively, oh, Fabulous. Yeah, franchise it to a local host university who then take responsibility for um, the, the academic standards. It, it, it is always linked to uh, a peer-reviewed journal. So the assumption is if you have a, a short paper or a long paper that gets through the review process, you can then move on to uh, a special edition of the International Journal of Mobile and Blended Learning. Uh, which will then lead to a publication maybe uh, five, seven months later. So, yeah, and, um, sorry, Agnes was the, was last year's president of the association, I'm this year's vice president, um, and historically people like Mike Sharples have been closely involved, uh, closely uh, involved down through the, well, into our second decade, I suppose, basically. So. Thank you. Well, thank you. Thank you very much indeed for, for being here. We look forward to collaborating and talking to you in the future. Okay. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you.